While many of the safety features on your car will protect you in an accident, the anti-lock brake system is specifically designed to help you avoid accidents. The heart of the system is the hydraulic modulator. This device contains a series of computer-controlled solenoids that regulate fluid pressure to the wheels during an ABS stop. Wheel speed is detected by electromagnetic sensors which on most ABS systems are located on or near the wheel hubs. The speed sensor converts the rotational speed of the wheel into an electrical signal. The ABS computer continually monitors the wheel speed signals. If a difference in wheel speed is detected as the brakes are applied, the computer will activate the modulator solenoids so that fluid pressure can be adjusted as required to the appropriate wheel or wheels. The computer also monitors the system for malfunctions and will alert you to the problem by illuminating the amber ABS or anti-lock indicator light while you're driving. As long as it is used correctly, ABS is incredibly effective at accident avoidance. However, if you pump the brake pedal during a panic stop, you'll only defeat the vehicle's anti-lock capability. That's why it's important to maintain firm pressure on the brake pedal and concentrate on steering the vehicle and let the analog brake system do the rest. On most vehicles, an illuminated indicator light means that the computer has identified a problem and temporarily disabled the system. While this means you'll be without ABS, the standard brakes will not be affected. However, you don't want to drive your car for too long without analog brakes, so have your service professional check out the system as soon as possible.